Yo, what is good, Sammy Out Squad? I just want to give you guys a big shout out for all the support you guys have shown across all my social media platforms and in Madden 21 this year, man. The Sammy Out Squad is the greatest. We are the best. We are undefeated. So we are going to do a big banger giveaway of the Madden 22 Dynasty Edition, man. The most expensive, the best way to get yourself off right in Madden 22. So it's going to be on my Twitter account, at Samios YouTube. I'm also going to leave the link to the giveaway in all of my YouTube video descriptions so you can find it there as well. But all you have to do is hit the like button on the post, hit the retweet button on the post, follow me at Sammy House YouTube, and tag one friend on the post as well. It shows in the graphic everything that you guys have to do on the Twitter post at Sammy House YouTube in my pinned tweet and in my YouTube video description. So make sure you guys are entering. It ends on August 6th, man. Good luck to all of y'all. I can't wait to see y'all in Madden 22. Hey. Yo, what is good, Sammy Squad? Back at it again with another video here today, man. We're doing a little comparison video today, man. I gotta stay right for King of the Packs. So I'm gonna be pulling a bunch of packs in the video today just so I can rank them in King of the Packs. So let's get into what packs we're pulling. And I got high hopes for one of these packs because last time we pulled some heat, we will see it is the Elite Pack. So I'm pulling all 10 of these, all 10 of the Game Changers. Um, fan appreciation's already pulled on this account, so I'm gonna go to another one and pull all five of those. And then I'm gonna throw an Ultima Legend fantasy pack at the end, you know, just to just to spice the opening up a little bit, man. You know, I gotta pull it every now and then just to see what's good with it. So before we do get into the pack opening, you know what I have to say though. Make sure you guys hit the like button right now. Hit the sub button if you haven't, man, because a lot of y'all watch the videos and haven't hit the sub button. I mean, what the heck are you doing, bro? Hit the sub button. And also put on post notifications, man. Join the Noti gang. Let up the comment section and let me know the order of the packs that you think, you know, from greatest or best to worst. So for me, obviously, fan appreciations at one. I'll go elites at two just because they did good last time. Game changers at three. Ultima Legends at four. So you have four packs you got to rank. I want to see you guys ranking all four of them. Just your guess on which one's going to do the best. So let's start with uh i'm gonna say uh, no let's open the ultimate legend first because i usually start from bottom to top for my guesses so we'll go ultimate legend fantasy pack and guys make sure you're entering my madden 22 dynasty edition giveaway link is in the description it's on twitter 82 tomlinson the first round could be glitchy that's what i have learned and when this is not glitchy it's usually gonna be a very buns pack so oh yeah this is easily the last pack. Unless we get, like, a crazy pull here. This is easily last pack. Yep. I don't know why I even waste coins on that pack. I literally say don't pull this pack anymore, and I still proceed to pull it every week. So, that is the worst pack. Like, we just lost 120k. So, we're just gonna... That's gonna be the bottom pack, hopefully. So, let's go Game Changers next, and then we'll go Elites, then Fan Appreciation. So, come on show us something good game changers are all elites too so we have a chance it's something 90 ted hendrix a lot of legends in that pack again um that's probably like 20k it's probably like 20k for all those cards so we need to see something good man full of 50 83 that'd have been nice full of 50 no full of 50 no oh my gosh bro the trolls are out today what the heck is this bro what is this? This is the type of packs that I pull, man. It just it is what it is. Game changers don't like me. They just don't. I feel like anything that's not a fan appreciation, training variety, like there's just a lot of packs that don't like me. And this this is one of the top packs that don't like me. I don't know why I'm pulling this pack, but so far my predictions are correct. Ultima Legends is the worst. Game changers looking to be if something's worse than this, bro, it's just gonna be embarrassing. All right, most fear. Oh my gosh, 91 Brian Dawkins. Thank you for a full one. How are we getting all of these? Like, I'm I'm just gonna keep moving. We're getting. First off, we had a pack with three the 50s. Now we have a pack just with campus trolls. Like everything is just trolling. It's probably an 87. How do I know the? How do I know these things? I just I just do. 83, 87 again, bro. Are we not gonna get one good pull? I, we might not get one good pull, guys. We might not get one. Full the 50. Nope, 86 Vic. Nope. Bro. Stop giving me stop giving me these animations if there could be buns. What is going on, bro? Oh my gosh, man. Four packs left. We have not gotten one good pull. Like, I don't think we've even gotten half our coins back in one pack yet. That's how down bad we are. 
Big flash. 93 Kittle. Oh my gosh, thank you. I was going to say, because this Kittle, I sold him the other day for like 45k. So this actually might have been a break-even pack. But bro, we're just getting big flashy Legend 87s. Not full the 50s. Like, oh man. This is a rough one. 81. Can we get like a coin quick sell or something? For, really? Guys, if this just doesn't go to show you what packs you should and shouldn't be pulling at the end of Madden... This is one of them. 84. Oh my gosh. I'm just not even going to get hyped for the 50s anymore. I just... This is a pack. This is a real pack, bro. 81, 81, 82, 82, 84. That's a real pack, bro. Like a real live pack. Oh my god, bro. Alright. And there's our ultimate legend. What is it? 87? 89. Okay. Okay. Ooh, the Mud Hero. Ooh, 95 Trey Turner. Okay, so we finally got something. We finally got something in the very last pack. So, guys, my predictions are looking spot on right now. Literally spot on. Ultimate Legend Fantasy at the bottom. Game Changer is right next to that. Now we're going to the Elite Packs, man. Come on, bro. Got to see something good here, man. Again, last time these packs did us right. But you never know. It's all luck with these. There is our guaranteed 89 guys this might be just a sell this might just be a full-on sell day by ea sports oh coin quick so come on be good be great come on 82 you know what i'm not mad fine with it i just like because this pack guarantees you an 86 plus and here's our 86 plus if that was the coin hey 95 eddie goldman not bad um if that was a coin quick so it's automatic like what is the 86 160k so that almost got us our coins back. We got a 95. So that's our first, like, good pack of the whole opening, man. We are just down bad. Um, let's keep going. Come on. Marcus Gilbert. Big Flash, 90. I'll take some coin quick sell cards, man. That That's, like, honestly, like, what I want to see. I want to see those coins popping up. Come on. Most feared. That, I was going to say, that better not be it. That better not be our card. Oh, my God gosh bro ea i know sometimes you gotta have your off days but man this is a very down bad off day that i'm having oh my gosh profit in like one pack the whole opening 94 jimbo okay that's not gonna it's that's like close oh, I'm, i don't know why i'm going to the game changers like i'm about to pull another one but um 94 jimbo is like what 30k something around there 84 Come on, man. Just give us something good. Heavyweight again. This ugly dude, bro. I, I don't know. I forget what I always call that dude, but that dude is always just bugging. All right, guys. This is just a troll of a video. Jordan Howard. Come on. Elite 84 Dalvin. All right, so this is our card, man. Be good. Come on. All right. Three packs left, man. Three packs left, dude. These packs are buns. Now you guys know why I have these in the trash every week. 94 Noah Fand. Okay. 85. Ooh, Vet. Okay, not bad. Not bad. Bad. Double 94s. That's actually... That might get us our coins back on the pack. So, the lead packs, we have had like two decent packs. But, other than that, it's been pretty buns. Free agent. 88. That is our card, probably. And, yikes. All right. Last elite pack, man. And then we're just going to get into some fan appreciations. This is just looking bad. We are down bad. Elite. Oh, my God. So, here is our card, bro. Come on. Be good. Big flash. 91 Mo Lewis. All right. So, let's just go check some of these prices while we're here. Because I am going to go on another account and open up the fan appreciations. I think my... I, I, I was, if the fan appreciations go the way I think they're going to go... I'm spot on with my estimates. Like, again, Ultimate Legend, horrible. Game Changer's pretty bad. Elites, we had a few good packs, but again, bad. So, fan appreciations, like, unless I'm getting, like, literal garbage can from those, that I don't think that they could lose. But I don't, I gotta knock on wood on that because for all I know, EA could really spit out some garbage. Um, I'm trying to look for a highlight, and there's, like, nothing here. Eddie Goldman was our best pull from the Elite packs, correct? I think. We had Trey Turner from the Game Changers at the very end. 
not really going for anything, but it is what it is. That was probably a break-even pack. Let's keep going. George Kittle was actually not a bad pull. Again, I sold him, I think, for 40. It was like 45K, something around there, so that's not bad. Um, Brian Dawkins doesn't go for anything, right? 20, all right. So nothing too crazy in the first three packs. So let's get into the fan appreciations and see if we can get some heat, man. Please, EA, please, some heat. All right, everyone. So we're on to the fan appreciation packs again. The whole beginning of this pack opening has just been buns, kind of how we predicted it. Hopefully you guys got the predictions right. We had no real upsets. So hopefully, as long as the fan appreciations do good, man, I just don't want to see any of the 50 trolls, any of that stuff, because we already got enough of that. All right. 97 dude i feel like i've never even pulled this guy what J um jamin davis jamin davis i don't even know how you say his name i feel like i've never pulled that guy in my life but 97 overall we'll take that 91 kevin Y already off to a good start already off to a good one again i'm gonna keep bringing up every time i have my worst fan appreciation pack opening i got 95,000 rings okay 95,000 training back in one of my five packs that was horrible wow okay we're having a good one here. This is this is exactly why I put the fan appreciations on top. 95, 96 in the second pack. Okay. We already are beat that one five pack by a bunch. Another rings. Oh my gosh. Who is it? 96. Okay. I'm still on the hunt for a 99 ultimate legend, man. I haven't pulled one in so long. The 50 troll. 93, Anthony Barr. Let's go. I asked, dude, fan appreciations are doing everything that all these other packs just didn't do, man. That's why I love them. That's why they are the king pack for me, and we'll see what happens this week in King of the Packs if the training varieties take over. Not sure. The 50. Did we, like, glitch the system? Did we do something here? <laughs> what, two back-to-back -back full of 50 and Anthony Bars? I've never done that, bro. Draft 94. Oh, my God. It rings again. What is it? 95, dude. We're getting rings. That's all I care about, man. I couldn't get rings at all yesterday. So, we will test, like, what, three rings? Or two rings? I don't even know. I'm just, I'm hyped. I'm so hyped about this one, bro. These fan appreciations are slapping right now. All right. 88. Draft. 96. Okay, I was like, we don't need any more rings. We got enough. 88. Dude, I'm curious to see how much training we're getting back here. And also, I don't think Anthony Barr goes for anything. Pretty sure that his card is like out of date now, but let's actually, I'm gonna check that real quick. 35K, not bad, okay. So that's, I mean, that's like a good little side biscuit. We'll take that. So let's see how much training we got. Again, I got 95K in one of my five packs and someone said they got 60K in one of theirs, bro. I was like, there is just no shot. You literally had to get 89 um, draft guys and 87 ultimate legends in every pack, bro. That's like insane. So let's see what we got. 287 that's a big profit day man love to see that bro okay fan appreciations so my predictions were spot on fan appreciation elite game changer and ultimate legend the game changer and the elites i feel like you could just like swap them they were like kind of even but again you know for the prediction love to see that um i actually don't love to see it. i don't love to see packs being buns but fan appreciations guys like i say if you want a pack to pull fan appreciations training varieties rookie premieres make sure if you guys haven't pulled those i've been seeing those 93 selling for like 70 80k now so it's profit just pulling that pack and selling the 93 so if you guys have side accounts if you guys have main accounts that you haven't pulled those just pull them it's just easy profit but again guys that's gonna be all for the video love to see the fan appreciation packs on top but i'll see y'all in the next video or stream man make sure you guys are hitting the like button hitting the sub button Put it on post notifications, and then I already asked you to drop your predictions, so you already dropped that. Make sure you guys are signing up for the Madden 22 Dynasty giveaway. I'll see y'all later, man. It has been real. Peace.